Hey, good morning, everybody. It's uh, Monday and Ju or July 26, and another day of the market report brought to you by Mike Bjork. Hope you guys all had a wonderful weekend. Um, a little bit of news going on today. We had the new home sales uh, being reported today, a little bit up higher than they, the estimate was, up at 330,000 uh, after a revision of 267. So they're still, you know, little, feeling a little more optimistic after that, you know, that really bad number, 267,000. Uh, you know, this is still one of the worst uh, numbers we've had, but, you know, they're feeling optimistic that it's up a little bit. Stock market's up based on that, as well as uh, copy or releases that FedEx sees some global growth. So they're feeling a little optimistic about uh, FedEx comments seeing that their business is picking up internationally. So those are all good news for, our, for the economy. So let's take a look at the bond market. Uh, as we on Friday, we basically closed at a you know a zero, so it was it basically stayed. So we were up about 12 basis points, I believe, and then it came down basically at zero, so it didn't uh, really go up or down. And uh, today we we started up, but now we're back down to that same level we left off on Friday, so we're down about 12 basis points. So not not doing too good today, and uh, as you can see, we're still kind of going a sideways pattern. Uh, it's probably going to at some point go up or down. It's possible we could see a revision going down or at some point. We do, uh, we can expect a, a pretty big correction at some point here. We are pretty far off the 100 and 200 day moving average. Uh, as you can see, here's the 100 day moving average here, 200 further down. So we are quite a ways off from that, those levels. So we could see some type of correction in the near, or sometime in the future uh, to bring us close to those levels. So, any else changes? I'll definitely get back to you guys. Uh, but as of right now, we're down a little bit today. Uh, but mortgage rates again are still looking pretty good. So, if you haven't refinanced, I'd definitely look into it now because now you can definitely see rates, no points. And I'm even seeing some no cost loans in the 4% range. So, uh, definitely consult your loan officer. Have a good day.